Shalom family, happy weekend to you. I'm so glad to come your way again with another word from the Lord for someone. It's just a quick one and I want to drop this before I go out. I just heard in my spirit right next door, right next door. And I kept asking God, like, it's been ringing in my spirit for a moment right now. And God was asking me, when was the last time you were grateful about what you now have? The things you now have, you used to pray for them so much. And you know, right next door, there is someone who is believing God for what you have. We get so lost asking God for new things that we forget to thank him for what he has done for us. We forget to thank him for being there for us. Right next door is someone who is believing God for the things you have. He's going to call them a miracle if it comes their way. And you are right here right now. You're believing God for better things. Of course, it's good to believe God for better things. But never fail to thank God for what he has done for you. Gratitude is one of the greatest principles that brings more to us. When you are grateful for God, to God for what he did or what he has done for you, he's going to give you what you believe him for. But when you fail to see the blessings that are around you, you become ungrateful. The psalmist says, count your blessings and name them one by one. And you're going to realize what God has done for you. So today, I want you to take a quick stop and ask yourself, what has God done for me? From the start of the year 2022, God has been faithful. Count your blessings. Name them one by one because there is someone right next door that is believing God for the things you have. You might not believe it. You might not see it. They might not even tell you. They might even be closer to you. They look at you. They envy you, but you don't know it. Right next door, someone wishes they were in your position. Someone wishes they were as blessed as you are, but you are here just now and thinking, oh God, I need more. Of course you need more. But do not fail to thank him for what he has given. God bless you. In the mighty name of Jesus. Amen.